for me, a typical day begins. Uh, I get up in the morning and I try to listen to some motivational vi- videos. Um, I usually listen to some positive affirmations because it helps me start my day a uh, positive. Uh, and I was given a a gratitude journal recently. Um, and I, in the mornings, I have I take two minutes to uh, think about what I'm grateful for. And not only I don't usually do like oh I'm grateful for my mom, my family. I try to pick out specific moments in my life so that it's more meaningful to the day. I. Uh, start my day with my team. So we usually all talk about what our goals are for the day and make sure that uh, the communication between uh, every person is aligned so that we're not uh, overstepping each other or doing something that someone else has already done. Me as a manager, it's my job to ensure that my team is still motivated and positive and ready to go and ensure that um, they have all the material and knowledge that they need to make sure that the job is done well. When you work with the vehicle, you're working with the field ops team or the vehicle operators. I will usually meet with their dispatcher and one member on my team to use their cars to ensure that the maps are being properly collected, as well as the data that we need to create for our machine learning team is being properly met. So there's specific parameters that needs to be met for specific machine learning models. If we need data for high pedestrian population, we will um, let the vehicle operation team know that uh, they need to either go to San Jose or San Francisco where there's a lot of people and we go out and collect data with them. So I wrap up my day usually with my team as well. So I meet with both of my teams to uh, make sure that there wasn't any blockers or challenges that they're they're seeing. And if there are, I'll try to see uh, if there's anything I can do on my end to help them. Or I will uh, listen to what uh, their ideas are to how to fix the problem uh, and try to lead them into the uh, right direction. So I have to, I mainly need with my mapping team since that team is larger. And we, yeah, we talk about what we can do better or what we can do next. And then the data annotation team, I also meet with her to ensure that the data is uh, properly audited and annotated.